Your Osnes, it appears we have some upset peasants at our palace gates. Is that so? Then I want you to take care of those pests immediately. Yes, of course, Your Majesty. And I want you to go as well, my daughter. Of course. Do not disappoint me, witch. I'll do my best, I promise, Your Wizardship. Citizens of Oz, please disperse or I'll have no choice but to remove you by force. To hell with you, witch. We won't stand for any more of your oppression. Uh, really, Glinda, must I do everything myself? Madame? Let me show you how we deal with these rebels. No, Madame, please. I beg of you, don't. Witness the power and wrath of the great and terrible Oz. All enemies of Oz shall perish. Have you no mercy? Mercy for them? Don't make me laugh, Glinda. They were nothing more than insignificant vermin. But you killed them, just like that. It's too cruel. What did you expect? The world is unforgiving and corrupt. But this is your dream, our duty, to work beside the wizard and bring righteousness and justice to those mindless imbeciles. Damn you, Marble. I never agreed to murder. And now you left me with no choice. Elfie, please forgive me. I know you told me to wait, but I can't any longer. It is time. By the power granted in me by the unnamed god, I summon the three guardians of Oz. You are called upon in times of need, and once more you are summoned to protect your land and people. You swore to devote your lives to save the oppressed. And now you are called upon for that very reason. Oz is no longer the peaceful nation it once was. Only you can save us from certain damnation. Go now. There's no time to lose. Save us. Oh God. Please. Anyone. Save us. Come on, Dorothy. Up and at them. Today's a bright new shining day. Come back in three hours. No can do. Can't have you being late for school. Ah, yes. That would be dreadful.